Retrieval augmented generation or RAG simply means providing more information or context to large language models or LLMs. For example, if a LLM has been trained today, tomorrow if you want to give it updated information, you would have to retrain it on a new data which takes long time and expensive resources. RAG is a technique which is used to provide that new information to LLM. The way RAG works is that it stores similar information together in numerical format, which is called as embeddings, and puts it in some vector database. Now, when a user asks something from LLM through a prompt, then updated information from this vector database is included in that prompt as context, and LLM receives the prompt plus this context as an input. This enables LLM to work on new data without retraining. There are various types of RAG techniques and new ones are emerging every week. Let's discuss three of them in simple language. Naive RAG, Agent RAG, and Guardrails RAG. Naive RAG te technique consists of naive text chunking and simple top K retrieval LLM. In Naive RAG, we split up documents into even chunks. Each chunk does not contain parent context. All chunks are stored in the same collection in a vector database. Then we find top K similar chunks from vector database collection and plug into LLM response synthesis model. The most common retrieval method is top K embedding lookup. Agent track term is mainly used in LAGJ. By agents, they mean a system where the sequence of steps is not known ahead of time, but is rather determined by a language model. This can allow the system greater flexibility in dealing with edge cases. However, if unbounded, it can become quite unreliable. As per Pinecone, a guardrail is a semi or fully deterministic shield that used against specific behaviors, conversation, topics, or even to trigger particular actions. The idea here is that to make sure that LLM are not used for malicious and toxic purposes, so guardrails are built into embeddings. This is a high level overview of this whole field. If you use any other RAG technique or want to add something what we have discussed, then feel free to specify in comments. If you like the content, please consider subscribing to the channel. Thank you.